This abandoned school opened in 1901. Unfortunately, this building had a shocking beginning. Eight years after it opened, lightning struck the roof, causing a fire to break out on the inside of the school. The fire severely damaged the building. The town was devastated about possibly losing their school. The city made the decision to repair the building and even double its size. The school was stunning for many decades after the renovations were made. In the early 2000s, a new school was built outside of town and the city transitioned all the kids into the new school. Scrappers invaded the building sometime after 2002. They would begin to steal any piece of copper they could find, even the copper pipes which would lead to severe water damage. Ultimately, that led to the school to sit and rot on the inside. The town has been hoping someone buys the property and brings the building back to life. If nobody ends up buying the building soon, the town will likely have it demolished in the near future. Now let's get inside and see what we can discover. Just made it into this abandoned school. They built this place back in like 1901. So it's really, there's a lot of, a lot of history here. It's still, a lot of stuff's still here and intact. It's really decamp, falling into a decay, a decaying state, but it's still really cool and worth it to explore this place. The water right here is really, oh, it's still ice in here, a little, oh, the water, dude. This is bad. Luckily, I think it's still kind of frozen. All right, so that is, oh, we can still make it through here. It's still kind of frozen here, but it's still, yeah, it's really flooded in here. I don't know where we're going. Some steps right here. Let's see where this goes. Oh my gosh. It goes into a, a gym. There's a gym in here. Oh my god, this is so cool. Look at this. This is awesome. All the basketball hoops do that. Yeah. Thing. If you look right up there, there's still a basketball hoop right up there. Look at that. Watch out for the nails. Yeah, there's nails in all of these. Basketball hoop there as well. And if you even look right here, there's another one as well. Just think about this. A lot of people in this smaller town, a lot of them probably grew up and probably went to school here at some point. It's a little crazy to think about. Yeah. And then look at the up there. Yep. They're, they're they got the stands weird. up there where they'd watch the basketball games. That's awesome. Some holes in the ground right here. We gotta be careful of. Let's see where this doorway takes us. Whoa, wait, what's this? It's like some drawer back there. Whoa, looks like some sort of, maybe like a trophy. A trophy case, something like that. And there's stairs right next to it, right? These, these doorways that enter into the gym. And then look, this must have been a ticket booth. This must have been a, t wait, there's a sign in here that says something. I wanna see what it says. Rules, always follow directions. Rule number two, be prepared, sit in squads. Rule number three, respect others. Keep hands and feet to yourself. Rule number four, when whistle blow, sit, stop, and listen. 
That that's is actually awesome. Cool. That's really cool. I wonder if someone just put that in here or if it's actually. No, I think that's like actually yeah. from before this place went abandoned yeah. and fell into the you know state that it's in today. Yeah. Alright, let's head on upstairs. I'm guessing that this probably goes up to the bleachers. That's right where we're under right now. Um, through this door here. Yep, that's right. Goes on into where the bleachers are. That was loud. That was loud. That's a, you could see the entire gym from up here. That's awesome. This is where a lot of the parents, maybe other students, would come on in here. They'd to watch the basketball games or what other what other events that they held here. That's so cool. All right, looks like we're getting into some of the actual hallways. So something to note about this school is there's actually a newer part of it and there's an older part. This appears to be like the older part, the part that was it looks like they had remodeled part of it. And this is not the side that they remodeled, obviously. Here's our first little classroom here. It's awesome. And if you look at that, a hallway full of the, what is that called? How do I not know the word of that? Insulation, yeah. there's the word. Look at the room. It's just all. You're right. Collapsed. Yeah, it's all just collapsing right there yeah, from water the, damage. The roof what? It was painted, but it's like tin or whatever. Yeah. Ceiling and painted over and white. Let's check out some more of these. Look, this must have been some sort of flo floor cleaner here, right? Yeah, that's fine. Something to clean the wood floors back in the day. What's soaking what? I wish my gloves were. All your gloves are? Yeah. Let's take a look right in here. Let's see what we got going on here. So this looks like one of the mechanical rooms. This looks like the air duct. And they had some shelving here where they maybe stored some of the stuff they needed to repair stuff. Yep, and here's some of the electrical boxes. They are scrapped. I guarantee you, these have been scrapped for a while now. Like, they're scrapped yeah. to they uh, crap. Nothing, I mean. Yeah, there's, they left nothing behind. And here's more storage back here. A little creepy in here. Classroom. Look at the chalkboard right here. So cool. Classroom right in here. Oh, look! There's lockers. It's awesome. Let's see what's right into. Maybe this could have been where the staff lockers were. So maybe one of the teachers area, whether maybe if they had lockers, yeah, maybe could have been something like that, or maybe for the youngest of the kids too. But oh yeah, pre preschool. That's that true. Makes sense because look, because then you room. come into this room, and it's really small. This room is really old as well. This is really destroyed from the water damage from above. But yeah, it must have been. I'm thinking maybe a preschooler room or kindergarten. Right. If you look right here, mm -hmm. there there are no locks here. Like you know, 
You don't have to spin a dial at all. It's just a pull up. I mean, you can put a lock right, right in there, but you know, they don't have them here. So to make it simple, but let's take a look at all of these ones. Oh, these ones are all the same way. So maybe that theory isn't correct. Oh, look at the top of the door frames. They come here. Look at the top of the fifth grade. So like this was like sections. Oh yeah, look had. at the top right up there. Yeah, it says fifth grade. Right up there. Look at that. That's really cool. Yeah, this was like fifth grade section yeah. of the school. So the fifth grade, yeah, all right. Quick little room in this classroom. this. Let's head on into room 401. Oh look, there's a desk still in this one with chalkboard over there. Look, a teacher's desk is what it looks like. Some other... And this is one of those, if you look at, looked at the beginning of the video from the outside shots. This is one of those actual pillars, you know, the little circle cylinder things or octagon things at the top of the school that you'll see, that you saw. So that was one of those. That's really cool. Oh, there's more lockers in a classroom in here. See, if I didn't see the uh, fifth grade thing above the door frame, I would think that uh, this would have been a preschool room because of everything yeah. shorter. Or maybe so, like one of the kindergarten ones. Yeah, yeah some, one of the younger age groups, you're right there. Yeah, because everything's shorter in here as you can see. Yeah, so. along with the lockers in the classroom. But we saw that tag, it's fifth grade. But those could also be outdated too. Yeah. All right. I think we explored everything on this floor. Yeah. Let's, let's head up. Next floor. Oh, here's. What does it say on top of this? Because this is fourth grade for grade four. You know. You're right. It says grade four. Let's take a look in here real quick. With more lockers in here as well. Yeah. All of them being shut this time. What does it say on top of this one? Literally nothing. Nothing there? No. Alright, let's continue on. Back this way, I saw some stairs over here that we can take to go up. So we're not at the top top yet. And then we still have the newer section as well. We gotta get the rest of the older section first. stairs here they are. All right, here's the next set of stairs, which is very strange. If you look here, there's stairs on the other side as well, and they go to nothing. I'll show you again once I travel up these stairs here. Really gross over here. So if we travel to that other side, it goes to nothing, just a wall. This is it's like they scary. almost like tried to hide it's almost like they tried to hide this part of the building, the upstairs yeah, part. Probably. I mean, this is scary, this floor. Yeah, this floor is really sketchy. Take some tapes into this room. There's more chalkboards still in here. Look in here as well. In the hallway. Oh, 
these rooms are for the most part identical. As you can see here. This here it appears to be. Oh, oh my gosh, that scared me. Yeah, look, dude, we got spooked oh, there. Yeah. Yep. If you look, hey, over there, there's some pigeons hiding up here. They're over there. They spooked us. See, anyway, look at, look at this. Right look there. at this ledge here goes on down you can see below there's a pigeon right there look at these chairs in this room look at these all oh, this floor doesn't feel stable at all <coughs> oh heck no let's get out of here dude because yeah we're on the tallest floor and there's a hallway that goes to another classroom there Let's head on over to the new, newer part of the school next. Look here, it's the locker room for the gym. I'm not gonna travel in there because of how flooded it is, but you can see how rusted away the lockers are in here. And one of them is practically about to fall over. You can see over there where it would lead into the gym. It's so cool. On to the newer part of the school. So when I say newer, it's not really new, but you can for sure tell the difference. Well, it's really dripping in here. So the water damage has really gotten to this part of the school. So here's the, here's the cafeteria, it says right there. Look at this place so flooded in here, I'm not even going to travel through there. It smells so musty. Dude, yeah, it's... Area. If only the, the viewers could smell what we smell right now. I know. It's... It's bad. Alright. Look, right look at that on the wall. <laughs> the, the paint there. The apple. And if you look right here, look, it's a different school it looks like. This isn't the one that we're in right now. I don't know why it's showing pictures of it, but it is. Is that one they were going to like destroy? This is when they were taking this one to be abandoned. I'm yeah, thinking. maybe when they were, they were showing moving them. into the new school and what the, the new yeah. school would look like compared to the old one. That's exactly what that was. The first bathroom I think we've seen here yet. Let's take a look. Look at the stalls. They're just so old school. That's awesome. Really cool. Here's the other side of the, the cafeteria. Can see right, right to there. That's where they'd grab their food from. And they're coming in here to eat. Isn't this side only one story high? Yep, only one story high on this side. So it's nice. But overall, this part of the school is a little bit more modern compared to the other one. Because if you look right in here, it's the offices in here. It's really fun. You see a lot more of the lockers over here as well. Look at this right here. So this is the, I think this is their sound system. The mixer they'd use to play play over the speakers. You know, that's where they would control the microphone over the speakers, any music they played for events or special, you know. Yeah. Anything like that. That's really cool. Here. Scooch over real quick. There's a, the box up there, say. Oh, it's an alarm box. Oh, That's shit. cool too. Cops what? gonna be after us. Cops now. coming, dude. <clears throat> oh no. Look in here as well. 
Got one singular bathroom in there. You know, this might not have, this could be like an office and, an, or it could be the normal main office and it yeah. could also be the nurse's office too. That's what the other room kind of looked like. Let's travel into here. Grade one. We're in a first grade classroom here. Ugh. All the cupboards they had here. The store, maybe pens, pencils, books, and other school supplies. You guys want your ASMR for today? What was that? Oh yeah, wait, let's take a look. A little ASMR down here. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. And then the chalkboards over there along the wall. Along the wall. Ooh. A little squishy. <laughs> Look at all these lockers. This is really cool. All right. This is a kindergarten classroom. Look at this. They had a random floating bathroom, floating island bathroom in the middle of the room around this circular. Okay. Yeah, it was like that a is... circular bathroom that sits in the middle of the room here. And then if you look over here, there's a baby car or a car seat, other toys right around here. Look at that. And then shelving here. So you can really tell that it's a kindergarten classroom. That bathroom is by your train. I've never seen any bathroom just in the middle of the Look classroom at this. Before. There's toys just sitting over here on the on the floor. Let's continue on. Into this room next. Grade two. Grade two. A grade two classroom looks like. Look at that. That's really flooding over here. You can hear the water yeah. dripping down. I'm not going to travel through there, to be honest. Where I draw the line. There's just a few other identical classrooms down there anyway. But look at that shot. It's kind of scary. Just, I just think we I think we've explored everything. Yeah. I'm thinking so too. So Vinny, what are your closing thoughts? This one It was actually It's like a time capsule, some of the stuff yeah, we found here. Because a lot of it's way older and everything. Yeah, exactly. So. There's we saw a bunch of toys that were sitting in that room there, floating yeah. bathroom, which is kind of strange, but yeah, I've never seen that yeah. anywhere. Like, Overall, yeah, really, really cool, different. Yeah. That's for sure. Yeah, a, a different vibe I've had at this one. That's not certain. Yeah, besides being musty. <laughs> yeah, it is musty. That is a negative side, but at least, you know what? Wait, hold on. Look at all these clothes. Look at all those. I wonder what those were for. But at least it's not like van as ma much vandals. Yeah. I mean, it is a little bit, and it's the scrapper's fault mainly. Whoever came in here and scrapped the place for all the copper wire, that's the reason this place is in such a bad state. So, make it back to the. I say, exit let's head out right here. Head out. After you, Schmitty, let's head yeah. on out of here.